in an intense showdown that stayed tight until the final moments at Fuente San Luis. It was Valencia Basket that eventually came away with the win as they defeated Kimki Moscow region 88 to 82 in the first quarter-final matchup between these two. Valencia grabbed its 13th consecutive win in this year's Euro Cup and could advance the semi-finals with a road win in game two at basketball centre of Moscow region in Kimki, Russia on Friday. This game started on a sour note as Slava Kravtsov was forced out of action with a twisted ankle and we wish him well. And following that, Fernando San Imaterio began to shine and became a reference point for the home team as they began to construct an early advantage. Vyacheslav Zaitsev responded with a triple as the Russian side enjoyed a run of 7-0. Valencia was able to overcome that and ended the first quarter with a 27-24 lead. In the second period, that lead began to increase despite the best efforts of EJ Rowland and Alexei Shved, who kept Kimki Moscow region focused. Romain Sato hit free throws in a 12-0 run that Pierre Oriola capped with a layup before Kimki called timeout at 36-24. Luke Sigma, Sam Van Rossum and Bojan Dubljevic stood out for Valencia, but it was San Emeterio who continued to be the star en route as the home team led 59-42 at the break. At the start of the third period, Oriola stretched the Spanish team's lead further, while Joan Sastre and Guillermo Vives also stood out for their displays. Hummel and Roland fueled a 0-7 run, which Sved capped with a fast break slam to bring Kimki back to life at 63-52. And a fast break layup by Roland soon got Kimki even closer at 65-56. Kimki made a real game of it and began to close in once more as they were able to take the game to 78-75 thanks to a jumper by Shved with under four minutes left in the fourth, fourth quarter. A layup by Marko Todorovic took Kimki closer again, 82-80 with less than a minute left on the clock. Once more, however, San Emeterio stepped up by hitting a critical jumper to take his tally to 17 points, eight rebounds and five assists in a great all-round performance while Van Rossen and Dubljevic added 11 each for the Spanish outfit. Dubljevic added 11 rebounds too for a double-double. Valencia dominated the boards with 57 rebounds, which was a Euro Cup season high, the third highest mark in competition history and the all-time record in a non-overtime game. Its 27 offensive rebounds is also a Euro Cup record. Valencia out-rebounded Kimki 57-30, which when added to the visitors' poor three-point shooting, Managing just six of 27 allowed Valencia to take the lead in the series. The tie is now perfectly poised for the second encounter in Moscow on Friday.